I'm just about to reveal one of the best use cases for ChatGPT that will allow you to make money online in 2023 and beyond without too much effort and that is copywriting. So let's get started. What you want to do is connect to openai.com and this is how you can access ChatGPT, which has been the subject of a lot of conversations lately. It literally exploded in popularity and everyone is talking about it. We can even verify that using Google Trends. If we go over to the worldwide chart here, we can see that it basically skyrocketed from zero to 100 with in the span of two weeks or so. And that is all thanks to its capabilities. It's not the only AI tool out there, but it's one of the best ones. And it's also optimized for a natural language, which means you can literally talk to it as if you're talking to a real person. Not only that, but it can do some amazing things. It can even write code. If you wanted to, you can ask it to write code and it's literally going to write a small program for you. But I personally think that the best use for chat GPT is content writing. It's also pretty good for research. But all in all, let me show you what I had in mind. This right here is how you're gonna make money using chat GPT. What you wanna do is click on this button and that will open the portal where you can start start interacting with the artificial intelligence. Just to get a little bit more background here, when it comes to its capabilities, it's literally going to remember what user said earlier in the conversation, so it's got some sort of memory. It allows you to provide follow-up corrections, and it can do some fascinating stuff. It can explain quantum computing in simple terms. It's also pretty good with creative ideas, and as mentioned before, it can even write code. However, it might occasionally generate incorrect information, so don't take it too seriously. And it's got limited knowledge of the world and events after 2021 so it's not entirely up to date with everything but that's not going to be a major issue for us if you connect to a place such as upwork.com which is one of the biggest freelancer marketplaces out there you can find professionals charging up to 50 80 or even over a hundred dollars an hour for their services as copywriters and we've got people here making multiple five or six figures to be entirely truthful, copywriting is a pretty difficult skill to master. It takes time and it takes a lot of practice. Now, there are a bunch of resources out there. There are all sorts of tutorials you can watch on YouTube and whatnot, but it still takes a lot of practice to get good at it and actually get results. If you think about it, copywriting is nothing else but the art of selling with words. And so it can be trained. It's as much a skill as it is art. And that's why we're gonna need some help. If you want to make money with copywriting and make use of ChatGPT in order to make everything easier for you, here's what you gotta do. First off, what we need to understand about copywriting is that just like any other skill, the riches are in the niches. So if you wanna stand out from the crowd in this highly competitive environment, what you wanna do is niche down and find something very specific that you're the best at. Instead of being a generic copywriter that does anything related to copywriting, what you can do is focus on email marketing or you can focus on creating captions for social media or content for social media. Let me give you some crystal clear examples. Instead of being a generic copywriter, you can focus on Twitter ghostwriting. If I copy that and head over to Upwork and search for it, you're gonna see the results I find are very, very limited. Only a handful of people will do that. And the same thing is true on Fiverr. Only 78 services available here. Another one is email copywriting and this is a huge one. There's a lot of money to be made there. Believe it or not, even in 2023, email marketing will still be a huge thing. A lot of money is being made by sending emails. You might think that nobody checks their inbox anymore, but that is not correct. In fact, major companies are still paying tens of thousands of dollars to copywriters for writing their emails so they can promote their products and services via email. Let me show you an example. I've just connected to digistore24.com, right? This is a huge affiliate marketplace for digital products. What you're going to notice is that some of of these products from these major sellers have an affiliate support page as they call it and they will send you all sorts of useful resources videos footage to promote their products and so on. But some of them will also have a list of email swipes as they call them. This is a list, a sequence of emails specifically created by a professional copywriter to help you sell the product. Let me show you an example. I'm just gonna click here on, I want to sell email blasts and take a look at this. If I open that Google doc, this seller is gonna provide me with a list of emails that I can send to other people to promote their offer. Guys, I'm pretty sure they spend a lot of money on these emails right here. Otherwise they wouldn't be sharing 
sharing them. Emails like this have already been tested, they've already brought huge revenue for the sellers, and this is the perfect use case for a copywriter. Once you get to the point where you're able to write emails for email marketing, you can make a lot of money. You can charge a lot for your services because not anyone can do it efficiently. Anyone can write an email, but not anyone can write an email that sells. Here's another one, sales page copywriting. If you connect to any sales funnel, it doesn't matter if we're talking about physical or digital products, you're gonna notice that the choice of words is not random. Everything is intentional about the wording on the sales page. That's the work of a copywriter. We're talking about writing articles for blogs and web pages, or even ebook ghostwriting, which is insane. You get to partner up with a famous person and write their books and you will get paid a large amount of money for it because they will also make a lot of money off of it by using their image to promote that book. Or you can also be a fiction or a non-fiction writer. But what about ChatGPT? Well, guys, it can pretty much do all of those and a lot faster than you and possibly better. And just to show you that I'm not just throwing words around, let's give it a try. Let's give you something very random to work with. Write a short story about Jeff Bezos in the Amazon jungle after he lost his business. Let's see what he can do. Remember, writing fiction is still a pretty profitable niche. I mean, if I connect to Fiverr.com and I search for a fiction writer, here's what happens. 1,400 services available and some of the top sellers are charging a lot for their creations. Not only that, but you can even sell your own books on Amazon if you want to and not necessarily work for someone else. The possibilities here are limitless. But what is for sure is that ChatGPT has just started creating our story and it keeps on going. But now guys, when it comes to creative works, these are pretty hard to measure. I mean, it's a very subjective area. You either like it or you don't. So it's pretty difficult for us to write the quality of fiction novels. From my experience, ChatGPT is pretty good with creative works as well, but it's even better with non-creative ones. Let me show you a very clear example. Writing an article for a blog. I'm not talking about a personal blog or a travel blog where you're basically just sharing your experiences from around the world, because that's something entirely different. That's where you need to do it yourself and add your own personal touch and narrate your experiences and so on so that you can relate to your audience. But when it comes to more technical sort of writings, ChatGPT can do an amazing job. Let's just say that I'm doing a little bit of research and I'm going to connect to YouTube and search for kitchen essentials for my first apartment, right? Or here's another example, 12 things you need for the perfect gaming setup. Again, this is more of a technical piece of content, right? But it's still a blog post. Well, if I just copy the title of this article, head over to ChatGPT and paste it in, let's see what happens. Let's see if it can come up with a suitable, relevant article on that topic. And if it can, well, we We've just saved a lot of time and as you can see it's doing it right now it's putting together a whole article a whole list of 12 different things you need for the perfect gaming setup why is that so great well here's why if you set up a blog and outsource all of the content creation process to chat gpt you've basically saved yourself a lot of time and so you can post a dozen different articles every single day because it only takes you a minute to create one and you can monetize it by promoting affiliate products which is what this blog owner is doing right here and this this is still an example of good copywriting. ChatGPT is writing your articles masterfully, is putting together all the information you need in a very user-friendly manner so that people can consume your content and if they want to, they can purchase these products that you're listing on your blog and you can make money with affiliate marketing. And guys, take a look at this. Believe it or not, it can also write a sales page copy for your dropshipping course. If you want it to, you can literally give it those instructions and it will start writing. It's even trying to persuade people. It's precisely what a copywriter would do. No. I'm not saying this is 100% effective. I'm not saying this is the best piece of copywriting you'll ever read because that's not the case, but it's using some pretty good strategies here. And that's because it's doing the research all over the internet, referencing various different sources and just putting the pieces of the puzzle together because that's what AI does. The thing about it is that it's gonna save you a lot of time. And so what I would personally do when it comes to copywriting with ChatGPT is drop servicing. I would set up my profile on Fiverr, Upwork, Freelancer.com, TrueLancer.com, People Per Hour, and all the other freelancing websites I can connect to as many as possible. I would list my services and whenever I get a new order, I would just connect to ChatGPT, forward the instructions to the AI, and have it do the work for me. If the client doesn't like the writing, I can just send it the instructions once again and get another iteration, all within the span of a few minutes. So it's a lifesaver. It's gonna save you a lot of time. And at the end of the day, once you get the result from ChatGPT, you can also take a look at it. You don't just have it to send it as it is. 
you can further improve it. But when it comes to the time it's gonna save you, that is undoubtable. It's gonna make everything a lot faster. Just as a side note here, for instance, Jasper.ai, formerly known as Jarvis, has been around for quite some time now. And it can do a very similar thing. It's an AI software used for copywriting. It can generate captions, video scripts, blog posts, art and images, or even marketing copy, or sales emails, or SEO content, or Facebook ads, or web content. And I could keep on going here for ages. There are so many different use cases for it. But Jasper.ai is not free. It's a paid software, it's a premium one, but I personally think ChatGPT can do the same thing for free. So I'm gonna leave that up to you. You've got everything you need to make it work. So that's it for now and thanks for watching.